different video than you're used to. I normally do vlogs, but today's video is going to be slight different, like I already said, but a little bit more exciting and interesting. So pretty much if you follow me on Instagram, you would already know that I and my two best friends came out with a bikini in collaboration with 437. And today is a super exciting day because the launch is very soon and you guys will be able to shop these pieces. But I do have some BTS that I wanna share. A little bit of behind the scenes on what we've been working on over the past few months, actually, not even a few months, it's been pretty much a year at this point. Um, and yeah, it's so exciting, it's such a great opportunity. I've always wanted to design something. So this has been so fun and exciting for us. But before the swim launches, I wanted to go through and answer some of your guys' questions, give you guys a little bit of a backstory on how this kind of came to be, and then we'll get into the good stuff, which is the behind the scenes. So pretty much um, we've been working on this collaboration with 437 for over a year now. Our kind of conversation started last February and we were going to be doing um, something else with them. And then once COVID hit, kind of changed everything and um, we were trying to figure out a new way to go about this partnership. So that's when we began the design process for the Joan bikini, which I will show you guys right away. But yeah, ever since then, we've been working on this really hard. I'm so happy with how it's turned out. We um, pretty much wanted just something that was very girly and feminine, but still sexy and beautiful for the summertime. And so that's kind of how this whole um, style was made. And obviously, we all three girls have very different bodies. And so creating some Thing that looks good on our bodies and as well as many other body types that are out there was very important and I have kind of talked about this on our podcast but I've always struggled with my body um, having body dysmorphia and just never feeling confident in a bathing suit and so I can honestly say I do feel so confident in this bikini I feel my best I like how the bottoms are not high-waisted but they're high-rised so they go a little bit higher up on your hip which I think is so flattering and I just think that the top no matter what your bust size is the Joan bikini top was catered to fit almost all bust sizes which is really great and really amazing um so yeah I'm gonna grab the bikini and I'll show you guys if you have not seen it already here is the bikini top it is so pretty we had this print um custom designed by a artist and she was working with the 437 team and she fully hand drew this material and or not this material this pattern she hand drew this material why do I keep saying that? She hand drew this pattern for us. Um, we kind of gave her the vision of just something really girly, floral, um, down to the Pantone color of this baby pink. Um, we all picked out and then she kind of took all of our um, vibes and visions and created this really stunning floral print, which I'm just obsessed with. And there's a little rosebud applique in the center, which is so cute. This was actually one of my favorite details that kind of became a trend last year. Um, I had a, or not I, my sister had a bunny growing up and on the bunny, she has a little rose applique like this, super beautiful. And I've always been obsessed with that ever since because when I was little, I always wanted that bunny and I always wanted to take it from my sister, but it was obviously hers. And so that's kind of how we came up with this. And obviously um, just some tulle trimming at the top, so flattering, very girly, very feminine, which is all of our styles. And so this is what the top looks like. If you guys are wondering, I am wearing a size medium in the top. I can post a picture right here, but yes, I'm wearing a size medium in the top and the bottoms. And I would say, 
okay um, if you are unsure on the sizing. I feel like the top is very true to size. Um, my bra size, in case you guys are wondering, is a 34C. And so I do have a very like, I wouldn't say I have a large bust, but I do have a very like medium sized bust. So medium size for this is really great. And then um, for the bottoms, these are the matching bikini bottoms on the Joan. And this is what they look like. They do look really skimpy um, right here. Like it does look like they are quite revealing, but I promise when they are on, it is not that revealing. I personally am not comfortable with showing too much of my butt area um, just because I don't really have a butt. Um, but this so flattering. I love that the bottoms kind of go higher, higher waisted up and they sit just like really nicely on your hip area, which I think is very flattering and looks good on everyone. Um, I already mentioned I'm wearing a size medium in the bottoms and I do think honestly, I usually do get a size small in bikini bottoms. Um, and I do feel like even though these are medium, they are a little bit tighter so i would maybe recommend if you are in between sizes to just size up um i don't think i'd be a size large in these because i'm wearing a medium right now but if you guys are in between sizes definitely go with these size up we also have the sarong which is stunning and i personally just feel so much more comfortable wearing this sarong like i've already mentioned before i truly do feel my best when i have a little high-waisted skirt or high-waisted shorts or some sort of like um like button down shirt something that i can just like feel a little bit more covered in so that's why i love the sarong i just think it's such a cute add-on um 437 had a really beautiful sarong last summer and that's kind of when we decided to reintroduce the sarong but in our print and then also a scrunchie which is so cute i absolutely love scrunchies because i have very thick hair and i just think with a bathing suit um, if you're at a pool or the beach or something at some point in that day you're going to want to put your hair up and i think just having matching scrunchie to go along with your set is so stunning and so i'm very excited We are on FaceTime right now, trying to figure out what well, we just figured out, I guess, the little applique color. We think we like it white as opposed to pink. What are our thoughts? Talk to me. Love it. It's the most flattering PFT stunning queen bikini I've seen. Yep. Absolutely. No, I know. We're gonna do measurements right now. I'll keep you guys on. This is so good. Our 437 bikini just <laughs> in the mail. I cannot wait to try it on. This is my first time seeing it, my first impression. It turned out so good. Oh my god, I'm literally okay. I need to try this on. I'm so excited right now. I've tried on. Okay guys, so we are at Floralista right now and we are shooting our bikini, which is so exciting. We have the whole space rented out just for the two of us today. And so we're gonna be doing this really, really pretty floral situation and there's just flowers everywhere. So we're gonna work with this space and it's gonna look so cute. We're obsessed with these chairs, but um, 
yeah, this is what it looks like and I cannot wait to show you guys what the photos look like. Stunning. So we just finished shooting for the day and the pictures came out so cute and the studio looked amazing. It's not, I mean, you keep calling it a studio. studio it's floral. It's a the floral, floral shop. shop. Floral <laughs> flower shop. Um, Floralista. Our studio today though. Yeah, our studio for the day, Floralista here in Fort Langley. Um, everything it turned out perfect. All the flowers stunning. If you guys are looking for any arrangements, always go to Floralista because they have the best, she knows the, the best check. flowers, she has the best flowers. She has um, the but yeah, so anyway, I don't know why I'm showing you the table again for the hundredth time, <laughs> but, so uh, but, um, we're going to go get lunch now. We had such a fun day shooting all this and the weather, it was like Weather was in and out, rain, we got sunshine, good stuff. We got good everything stuff. turned out stunning. So obviously by this time you're seeing the vlog, you've already seen the bikini. Um, but yeah, we're March so- March 24th. Yeah, March 24th, we're so excited and it's just gonna be, it's just gonna be an exciting time, so. We can't wait to see yeah. you wearing the Joan. Yeah, we can't wait to see Nitz's pictures because she's shooting tomorrow in Toronto. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna stop rambling, but yeah. Goals. <laughs> okay, okay, bye. bye.